We pray for their hands, that their hands would be clean. Smile down upon this commission meeting. Bless the minutes. You will bless what is spoken to accomplish for this great city and that it will prosper for each involved. Amen. We, we could have used you last week. Next, we're going to go to public discussion. So if anybody would like to speak on anything that is not on the agenda, you will have three minutes to do so. So at this time, we'll open it up to public discussion. Today, I would like to speak about something that um, happens sometimes at these meetings. Um, I know that many of you are passionate about your ideas, but sometimes that passion carries on to a behavior that, in my opinion, is a bit above what should be. And just because you didn't know that, don't get all... I do know that. that. I do know that. It feels to me that is disrespectful. Pushing your opinions on other in a way that is a bit too much, and even though it is okay to disagree, sometimes the arguments get really ugly, and it's really embarrassing and upsetting for the residents. Oh my God. I have heard from residents that they don't want to come to the meetings because of the arguments and disrespect. I thank you for not doing this to residents, although it has happened occasionally, but not too much and only from two commissioners that I can remember. Run against me, you can sit up here. You have to give your opinion and express your feelings. And I know that because of the Sunshine Law, this is the only place where you can do that. But be respectful and considerate of your fellow commissioners because your behavior is a reflection on our city. So I just want to say, you're probably referring to me. I'm very passionate about when items come up and we don't get to discuss them and I last know. meeting, I was asking Commissioner uh, Vice Mayor Schwartz about her vote. I was questioning it. I know what you're doing. So it's very hard because, like, it, it's something that has to be exposed out in the public. We can't do this behind the scenes. And tell me, I'm going to tell you, if it was behind the scenes, it would probably be worse. So we're up here. We're expressing our views. We're doing what we can. But to sit here and be like a robot and just rubber stamp everything, that's not me, so I'm just going to be I candid with everybody that I, when I talk about an item, if, it's, I know. if it means a lot to me, I know because that item, it's not that it meant a lot, but it was representative of 350 people that made comments that were against it. And to sit there and give them no voice in our chamber, I'm yeah. not going to do that. No, I understand. So if I lose it every now and then, I apologize. I understand, and that is why I said that I... I understand your passion, but sometimes when it gets ugly because it goes between you and some other commissioner, I'm speaking, sir. Relax. it gets really um, embarrassing. People don't get what they want and sit on the end sitting there crying and make faces and throw their hands up. Those are the people you got to watch out. I don't think it's embarrassing. I really don't. Well, you don't if somebody because wants you're to the look one at... doing it, so you don't find and, and it And I can tell you this, that if anybody doesn't want to come to a meeting, have them call. Call us, call. And, and I want to find no, out why no, they don't no. want to come to a that's, meeting. But to that's... say people don't want to come to a meeting, I think that's being very mis well, mistruthful. No, it is. It is. And, you know, the same thing happened in our association. They said that they didn't want to come to our meetings because the previous board was always fighting. So uh, I know what it is, and so I do appreciate that you have passion, and, but I also would like a little, not only from you, I, I'm not only saying you, from everybody. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, is there anybody else? Um, I do agree with her to a point that, you know, name calling is not really necessary up there between you adults. I, that's all I'm going to say about that. You're a poet. Um, I want to kind of agree about the disagreeing to agree with each other. But if you don't want to be bashed, then don't bash somebody else. Don't call them bullies. Bully is the one who accuses people of bullying. When there's not a bully up there whatsoever. And Tommy, thank you for your passion. Everybody that has passion, thank you. Because you're speaking out for us, the residents. And that's who you should be speaking out for, the residents. And keeping the residents happy. Um, the last meeting, well, let me start off with, I believe that it is illegal to 
uh, campaign in a municipal building like this. Um, so I think that it also should be illegal for a sitting commissioner to be bashing a candidate that is running <clears throat> the only one that was in the meeting, the previous meeting. And if it's illegal to campaign, it should be illegal for a sitting commissioner to anti-campaign. Anybody that doesn't know what I'm speaking about, rewatch the last meeting and you will see exactly what I'm speaking about. We gotta have money. That's why we're up here and we're not. Because you can't just spit things out and think, oh, we'll do some this, and you have candidates coming up here talking with no solution. Come up with a solution. Know what you're actually talking about. Um, with that being said, I was at the parade and I enjoyed it. Um, the residents that I was sitting with enjoyed it. And it was nice seeing some of the commissioners were smiling when they were walking by and, you know, made the residents feel welcome. And thank you for doing that. Thank you. Is there anybody else that would like to speak? No? 